So hi everyone, welcome back to the channel, the channel where Mick reviews stuff. Today we're going to take a look at a battered box, but uh, in there, from Timu, we've got a hair grading kit. We buy these things online and from magazines. Some maybe not what they seem. We're here to look and call it up. Thanks for watching while Mick reviews stuff. So let's take a look at this item. I've actually just looked at the uh, email of the confirmation email when I ordered this and this device was £2.13 pence. so we can't really complain too much at, uh, at the way it came. That's one thing with Timo when they shove things in a bag they shove things in a bag. Shipping must be at a premium and they make sure they don't spend any more than what they've got to. So let's take a look in the box. So what we have is a hair, hair clipper and a set of foils to go over the top so you can have set the millimeters of uh, hair that you require to have left or if you just use it with the actual blade on it you could end up with no hair left at all a bit like myself also in there there is a brush to obviously these things gain hair as your uh, trimming away so that's just to brush it off there was a charging cable somewhere but I don't know what I've done with that um, it must have fell out of the box now I've seen these on Facebook popping up in ads as, as they tend to do nowadays Not, nothing much on Facebook apart from ads uh, and the way they were marketed and photographed on there you could have thought this was a piece of gold shows you all sorts of hair designs that you can do with them now I haven't got a lot of hair so I'm not sure as uh, I'll be able to test it for that but this would just be a handy thing just to throw in a, uh, a piece of hand luggage. Obviously, when you travel on an aeroplane, you have to put um, enclosed batteries in your hand luggage and uh, and just take over it. You know, if you want to trim up while you're there, trim the sides of your hair or whatever you do. Keep yourself looking fresh. But as, as for the gold, nothing could be further for the truth. This is just a, a piece of plastic, basically. And, uh, and it feels reasonably cheap, but at £2.13, it's bound to, really. I'm not sure what goes on there. That sort of looks like a ram, doesn't it, that shoves in. But I'm not really sure what goes on there. So let's just take the foils out and click them on. Excuse the crackling noise. Let's see if they actually fit. be interesting to see how it goes. So what's that one? That's a four millimetre. Not sure if you call them foils, that's what they used to call them. Let's give that a good old press, see if I can get it to click on. It does, it actually stays on. So that's in case you want to get your hair down to uh, Four millimetres. I didn't think that was going to click on there. I expect. I thought that was just going to be a fairly off thing. Uh, that wasn't in very good, um, wasn't very good quality. But it does that fits on there nice and snug. Let's see if we can get it back off. That's quite easy. Just put your nail under there, and it comes straight back off. There's also a three millimetre, a two millimetre, a one point five millimetre. And I'm not sure what this would be if you just use the blade. And you never actually managed to get right down to the uh, to no hair. You usually end up with a bit of stubble. So I'm presuming this is like a grade one or something, you know, one millimetre. So we've got the scales out. Let's just see what this weighs. Just to give you an idea. 62.83 grams. So that'd be really handy to fit in your hand luggage, not take up much weight. In case you're going away for four or five days on a business meeting or something like that, and you need a bit of a trim round of your hair. Now, the only downside to this I can find, obviously there's the charging port underneath. And that's, as you can see, it's the, it's the switch. The only downside to this I can find is it is quite noisy. So I'll just give you a demonstration of the noise. <laughs> it 
you know when it's working. <laughs> I'll see if that goes down actually when you put a uh, put something on, whether it's just those blades rattling away because they're not covered by anything. Gotta be worth a go, isn't it? No, it's just as bad. <laughs> So that's, took a look at that. Obviously, we just got through the design. It's got a dragon design on there. There's a lot of things in China. Of, it's actually quite a nice looking thing, to be really honest. Bit of good oriental with some symbols around there. No idea what any of this means. Uh, and again, around the bottom, just to make it pretty. Now, it don't come with a case or anything like that, but you can't really expect a lot for £2.13. I mean, basically, if you took this away with you and it lasted two weeks, you haven't really lost a lot of you. But all in all, it's really good quality, especially for that price. Uh, these things, if you uh, get the real versions, the branded versions, and, you know, you're always 40, 50 quid, aren't they? Just to uh, keep your hair trimmed down. So let's see if it works. I'm, I'm not a man with a lot of hair. So let's, uh, let's sacrifice a few arm hairs and uh, let's just see if it actually does work. Again, there'll be a bit of noise because I can't do anything about it. Straight down, all gone. Where's well, the treat? Just to show you, that's what came off my arm hairs. Bit of manscaping. So that basically just shows you how good some of these products are. So it's a bit, a bit gaudy, a bit loud, and a bit noisy. But uh, for two pound thirteen, to uh, take care of your manscaping. Or ladyscaping, uh, it can't be a bad deal. And I say, if it lasted for you for uh, for a couple of holidays and then decided to uh, to never work again, you haven't really lost a lot, have you? Anyway, thanks a lot. Catch you soon. Bye bye. We buy these things online and from magazine. Some maybe not what they seem. We're here to look and call it bluff. Thanks for watching. Bob make review stuff.